Hello, my name is Paul Trilsbeek. I'm the head of the Language Archive at the Max Planck Institute for Psycholinguistics in Nijmegen, the Netherlands. Just very briefly, what is the Language Archive? It is a research data repository containing uh, data collections resulting from a number of language-related research disciplines. We have about 400 collections covering uh, materials in more than 250 different languages that are spoken around the world. An important part of our collections concerns the languages that are endangered in the sense that they are no longer being passed on to future generations, so they may no longer be spoken uh, within one or two generations if this trend continues. 64 of our collections have been added to the UNESCO Memory of the World Register in 2015. So we're essentially both a research data repository as well as an archive of cultural heritage. The main issue for us for the coming years will be the migration of our repository solution. So at the moment we're using a legacy version of the Fedora Commons repository software, on top of which we're using the previous version of the Islandora uh, user-facing front-end. Um, this Islandora version 7 that we're using uh, is built on top of uh, the Drupal content management system version 7, which is scheduled to become end of life uh, in November 2022. Uh, continuing to use it after that date is an obvious security risk, so we need to have this migration finished before that date. Newer versions of these components have been available for some time already, uh, but in particular uh, Fedora and Islandora have been rewritten from the ground up uh, and are completely different in terms of the architecture, so the underlying data representation and APIs. Migration tools are available, uh, but need to be adapted to our metadata and data structures. Um, also, we need to adapt custom components that we've added to this framework, and we need to adapt our custom ingest pipeline. So in all, it's quite a significant task, but we're optimistic that we can get this done before the November uh, 22 deadline. Thank you very much for your attention, and I'm looking forward to any comments or questions you might have.